Hello blokes. Um, I know it's been a minute since I've made a YouTube video. Um, I don't even remember actually. Last time I actually talked in a YouTube video. Um, I decided to do an update video, especially since I've been getting a trinkle of new followers, so welcome guys. Um let's see. I guess well since I've always done videos about my ears. Um, right now, they are half inch plugs taped up. I downsized because I had a blowout, a healed one, and um, I got rid of it for the most part. It's still there a bit, so I downsized for a little bit, and um, while I was going back up, I decided to tape up because while I was at half inch, I was able to um, fit 916s in because I bought a pair of 916 plugs. But, like, it just fits, so I'm stretching up past 916 so I can fit double flares in because I think I'm going to stop at 916, um, which is 14 millimeters. Um, what else? Ah, um, I got my septum pierced. Ah, early February. I got it pierced in um, early February. Um, I went to a different shop than I usually go to, and they were really nice. They gave me sea salt and a little pamphlet, and he gave me his name and number and stuff if I ever had any questions. So I thought that was nice. I like it. My mom doesn't, of course. It is pierced at a 12 gauge. I can't wait to get more jewelry for it. Um, I'm also a pescatarian. I decided to do that January 3rd, so it's been a little over a month now. Um, I'm enjoying it because, oh, and a pescatarian is someone who doesn't eat any type of meat products except for fish, and then you can or cannot, if you want, depending on you, um, eat and drink dairy products or poultry of any kind, like eggs and stuff. Um, I personally eat eggs and milk still. I just don't eat pork, beef, chicken, any of that stuff anymore. Um, I tried last year, late last year, uh, to do this, and I did it for like three, four weeks, and then I stopped because it was in November-ish, so Thanksgiving, and then I went to New Orleans, and I wanted to be open for that to like try anything while I was down there. Um, but now I've stuck with it for a little over a month and I've made a lot of drastic changes. Like now I can't just pick up some frozen chicken strips and throw them in the oven and call it a meal. Like I have to actually think of meals that I want to fix for myself. And with that, I make more smarter decisions about what I eat because I've tried like putting more veggies and stuff in my like meals that I make and um, I've been finding a lot of recipes and so I've been um, making a lot of foods based off the recipes so I found like plenty like I've discovered so much like I made vegetarian enchiladas with like black beans and corn and stuff and I usually don't eat beans a lot period but now I eat them much more which has a lot of protein I've tried quinoa which is a type of grain and it has a lot of protein in it and it's really good I hated oatmeal before and I just tolerated like the instant stuff um but now I and I tried making like the cooked oatmeal and I hated it and now that I'm a pescatarian I've been trying stuff with like almond milk and I discovered I like cooked oatmeal if it's with almond milk and then I'll put a little bit of brown sugar I love malt powder so I'll put some malt powder in it and then I'll add a dollop of peanut butter at the end and shake cinnamon over and it's so good oh my goodness um also I don't like greens like when you cook like bitter greens mustard greens and stuff I I don't I'm not a fan of greens but um, my grandma fixed kale not too long ago and that was delicious I am obsessed I want more and green beans like it's another like pescatarian thing because we make green beans and we use bacon fat and everything in it and so I can't eat it 
and I we ran out of kale and I was like oh let me fix some green beans and so I did and I'm like how am I gonna season it and I found like a, a vegan youtuber who finds ways past that because she's southern so they use meat in a lot of their um, veggies and stuff and it tasted really good I loved it so I'm finding like alternatives that are healthier which is awesome um, and with that like I feel better excluding now because I'm sick so sorry if I sound nasally um, I'm finding that like I feel better about myself like inside and out and so I end up I've been working out more like I did yoga here and there last year but now I try to work out if I'm not sick, I try to work out as much as I can during the week. Um, I found a YouTuber, um, Bloglotties. I do those videos as well as Terra Styles, mainly yoga videos. And I try to do it in the morning before I go to school. Um, so I'm getting toned and everything, so it's like it's a great transition. Um, I'm not sure what other video. Tell me if you like want me to do like a tag video or anything. I might do a February favorites if I can get everything that I want to put in the video together and I have enough free time to myself to make said video. Aside from a favorites, a February favorites video, I'm not sure what else I could do videos about. So let me know if you have any suggestions. Welcome again, new subscribers, and. Feel free to comment, rate, and subscribe. I will I will try to make more videos. It's just really hard to do. Um, and you can follow me on Tumblr and on Instagram. I also have a Blogspot blog that I've kind of neglected over the past couple of weeks because I've been busy with school and everything and so I'm thinking like oh I should write about this and that and this and it's getting to the point where I want to write about, write about everything and I don't know where to start so I just haven't wrote anything in the longest time so um yeah um I'm pretty sure that's it as far as updates go so like I said Instagram and Tumblr will be in the down bar as well as the blog spot blog uh, feel free to follow those too and remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. Peace.